Hey guys, Herman here in another Just My Review and as you guys can see I received a box right now from Amazon and what we got here, well, I got the Bar Links from Mug. As you guys know, I love this brand and this is gonna be easy and quick. If you guys feel vibration in your steering wheel or you feel something bad when you're driving any noises at the bottom, probably can be these guys right here. It's the most common thing in the 2014's escapes and this is going from the 13 up to the 19 i don't know the newer models but well guys let's go and do this right now and see how the, it looks like all right guys let me show you first what is inside this box and right here i got this bar link from Mug, and also one thing I love from this company is that right here is not only a regular bag, but right here is telling you guys the uh, torque specifications. As you guys can see, take a look at right here, it's 39 pounds. Uh, the specifications for this uh, uh, torque, and in it's telling you this, not everybody do that but these guys are doing it for us and it's something i really appreciate from mug uh, you can recheck uh, the specifications from uh, four or any other make to make sure you got the right specifications but it's something good to know in case we don't know exactly what is the torque all right let's go and take it off this tire and uh, we're gonna lift this pickle and we're gonna remove the old bar link all right guys before you guys remove uh, your bar link make sure to grab your bar the new one you guys have and compare it with the uh, with the uh, new one and make sure it's the same length as you guys can see this one right there this one is exactly the same length and well we can do it because Sometimes, uh, depending if it's an aftermarket, if it's a, oh, and it's no problem, but if it's an aftermarket, sometimes they got a different sizes, depending what you need. And I don't want you to guys get screwed up. All right, we're gonna remove first these guys right here. And that one in the bottom, right there. I'm gonna put some lubricant before I do that. Let us see for a few uh, minutes. And then we are going to remove this, all right? Hey guys after a few minutes uh, they are ready and they already loose uh, I just using this wrench right here and I use them for the bottom piece and using a fix with a ratchet and it's easy to go now sometimes uh, this is like in my case this one I don't have any need to put anything down here uh, for some reason well some guys need it to just to remove tension from the bar they have to put it down here and lift it a little bit but in my case this one doesn't need it I just gonna remove this one out of here as you guys can see this is completely loose and I don't need to put the jack in order to lift this one to remove pressure from here in my case look at this it's, it's completely loose and that's what I'm gonna do. Let's remove the uh, nuts and pull this thing out. All right, just let's remove this guy right here. Ready? And take a look, guys. I don't have nothing there, nothing here. And this guy is coming out super, super easy. Let's remove this guy from here, and that's it. <clears throat> okay, that's it. And I didn't need the jack in order to get this guy out. Now make sure yours is loose. You know you got a good play right here in these areas in order to remove it without that otherwise if you feel any pressure you have to use the uh, uh, jack right let's go install the new ones okay now guys take a look comparison both of these guys um, probably is nothing but uh, 
look at the thick of this one comparison to this one and if you see the details of the construction I know this is an old one but you don't see in the oven any uh, fitting to grease it light the guys with mug take a look guys you guys can grease this thing now this one uh, don't do the same mistake I did I put a lot of grease in the first one and uh, this one is already uh, greased inside just put a grease once in a while gonna be enough but take a look the difference the construction of these guys and well this is quality I love this mug and I'm telling you guys right now I'm telling you I'm not getting paid by mug just I'm reviewing for all you guys because I know for me it was uh, took a little while to find out a brand a good brand that uh, you know can I uh, that I can use uh, in my vehicles now take a look at right here more clearly you guys see uh, the uh, torque in these guys is basically uh, 39 pounds 39 pounds and you have it in different languages you guys got it in English Spanish and I think this is French and well guys let's go and connect these guys tighten up and that's it how it looks like all right as you guys can see mine went in real real smooth I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry right there no air force at all just put the screws that's it all right as you guys can see mine went in real real smooth I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry right there no air force at all just put the screws all right guys let's go and do the torque that's it all right guys and that was it and to finalize the video let me give you guys the part number right here from mock this is the k7505 54 you guys can post the video in order to write this thing down also last recommendation guys depending on the vehicle you guys have make sure to check what is the prepared torque for your specific escape uh, in my case I use honestly at the end I was changing in to 41 pounds uh, look at this beautiful guy right there look at how it looks like and look at the uh, grease fitting so so nice don't put too much grease on those uh, just I think one is going to is going to be enough but guys like I told you uh, some guys have different uh, measurements for the torque in these uh, escapes and I see the range between 35 up to 48 pounds depending I think 48 pounds is too much but honestly I cannot say for sure that's what I'm telling you to make sure and check your specific uh, torque for your vehicle in my case like I told you guys Mox is 39 but I put 42, 41, 42. I think it's good enough. I feel the same strength when I remove these uh, nuts from the bar links. And well, guys, that's it for today, guys. Uh, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, share the video. Guys, I'm going to put the links down below. That way you guys can uh, uh, get this product from Amazon. And well, God bless you again. Subscribe to my channel and see you guys in another Just My Review. Bye-bye.